It is the 6th of the 8th, 2014. This is your radioactive reality. Day number 1244. Any news? Let's get started. Big surprise story. Newsflash! Meltdown at Fukushima worse than thought. Most of nuclear fuel melted through reactor number three and continued down to the bottom of outer containment vessel. Has changed their understanding of what has happened inside. So over 42 months later, big surprise. Hey, at least they're admitting number three melted through and is out of containment and in the environment. The big mystery continues. Alaska, scientists alarmed by new mystery disease. Hmm. Pacific Northwest, alarming changes. Couldn't believe my eyes. Scientists really stumped. It's a kind of alien thing. So now they're blaming aliens because they don't know. Big mystery. Quote, gotten much, much worse. A horror show could wreak havoc on entire ecosystems from Mexico to Alaska. But don't worry, folks, these brilliant government scientists have stated that, hey, there's no way the radiation from Fukushima could have reached the West Coast by now, when countless studies have proven otherwise. Round and round, deceits, lie, insanity. New report estimates 700 or 278 trillion becquerels of plutonium released from Fukushima reactors over 200 times higher than amount reported by TEPCO. I'm sure these numbers are very low as well. Quote, highly radiotoxic when incorporated into human body as it decays. But don't worry folks, there's no immediate danger. They've got everything completely under control. In comes the UN. UN whistle blow, uh, whitewashing Fukushima catastrophe. Yet the report reveals Quote, more than 9,000 people will die of cancers. Number likely much higher if correct data is used. If they would only use the correct data, well, that might cause panic. Professor, quote, it's brainwashing, an infamous lie, and abuse of science. Their own data contradicts their public conclusion. You think they're hiding something? You think they're not telling us something? How wrong is this? How bad is this? We'll never know. Because they keep dancing around and dancing around. Liability and profit. Fukushima globally enhanced cesium-137 levels in air by two to three orders of magnitude. And we all know this cesium-137 likes to run all by itself with nothing else with it. Mm, what about those 1300? other radioactive isotopes that get released alongside of cesium-137 or strontium or cobalt-60 or any other of these oddball isotopes that they keep throwing out one at a time. Don't worry, it's just one of these things. It's not one of these things. It's over 1,300 of these things. And it's in the air. And it's in the water. Plutonium from Fukushima went further than Chernobyl. Yeah. We already had reports that it circled the entire northern hemisphere in four days. The entire northern hemisphere. <sighs> Excuse me. Sample was from site farthest from Fukushima plant. Concerned material is flowing into Pacific Ocean from land. Well, yeah, they've had three breached containments. The coriums have left the building and are down in the environment, seeping directly into the Pacific Ocean, on top of all the other water madness that these guys are doing, pumping it directly into the Pacific Ocean, not to mention the open incinerary burning that the Japanese does to their garbage. They've been mixing this radioactive tsunami debris and everything else in with their garbage and burning it, releasing it into the air, and of course it gets blown over to the United States. The story goes on and on and on. But don't worry folks, the Yakuza have it completely under control. It's a Japanese Mafia, if you don't know what that is. Huge increase in dead and sick mammals on California coast. 
unprecedented numbers, annual record broken in seven months, starving, drooling, brain damage, suffering seizures, sea lions mysteriously vanishing on the other side of the Pacific. Uh, the Russians are having a hell of a time with their sea lions, dying off in droves. Expert, we didn't know what's hap We don't know what's happening. Of course, they're going to blame everything, everything but the nuclear industry. Government report. Ooh. Over 1,750 uh, Navy sailors suffer from ill-defined conditions after exposure to Fukushima radiation while aboard the USS Reagan. Significant increases in male infertility and childbirth complications. Dozens have thyroid disorders, many spontaneous abortions. Veteran extreme measures used to cover this up. And of course, they are working very hard to make sure this information doesn't get to you, the general public. What would you do with it anyway? Hmm? Take it to Walmart, buy something else on special made in Japan. Lab director, expect radiation spikes coming from U.S. nuclear facility. This is WIP. Government pays for more air monitors to see impact on populated areas. They want to see the impact. DOE warns of uh, ignability or ignitability of 368 containers at site. Sific significant fire risk. Top official material at WIP just disintegrated, got very hot very quickly. And uh, what they're talking about now is sealing off completely um, storage areas 6 and 7. Um, where the reported collapse happened anyway, so they're just going to bury this whole thing and um, just pretend it didn't happen. I, I really don't know what's going on at WIP, and they just keep going round and round and round and round. And I mean, we've seen this over and over and over again. Of course, the insanity continues. Millions of fish dead at Oregon coast. Craziest thing I've ever seen. You can't blame people for being alarmed. Aquarium, quote, it kind of looks like the apocalypse, especially big numbers. But this is a sign anchovies are doing good? Question mark? They're trying to spin a positive thing on this story. The insanity continues. And again, these people have no idea because nobody wants to look at the obvious. Millions of fish found dead on California coast. Three major fish kills in two weeks. Unidentified goo floating nearby. Please clear out beach. Call health officials in to investigate. But don't worry, folks. Everything's perfectly under control. Tokyo professor sur surges in airborne radioactive releases have gone on for years at Fukushima. And every other single nuclear power plant on the planet. Shut them down. Shut every single nuclear power plant down. Every one of them. <sighs> Radiation alarms sound for hours at plant. Extensive area being impacted. Yeah, the entire planet's being impacted. Report worst he's ever seen, says Alaska boat captain. Fishermen talk, uh, talking about Fukushima, convinced it has something to do with it. Salmon not showing up. Many have lesions or worms and parasites. Crabs more easily damaged. A lot of dead catch. Herring, cod, halibut, pollock catches dropping off the cliff. Something mysteriously big is going on in the Pacific Ocean. Well, we all wonder what that is, now don't we? Nuclear waste flowing out to sea from underground tunnels at Fukushima. 950 billion becquerels of cesium in Unit 2 shaft next to the ocean. 1,100 tons estimated in tunnels. Stream, stream of moving water. Government regulators urgently assessing the problem. Sense of crisis is needed. These tunnels run throughout this nuclear power plant. And the coriums have left the building. Of course it's leaking. And it will continue to leak for millions and millions of years because these guys really have no idea how they're going to get this stuff out of there or what they're going to do to stop it. They're doing
doing everything they can to control the information coming out of Japan and what's going on in the Pacific Ocean on the west coast of the United States and the entire northern hemisphere. It's an ongoing, ongoing challenge for them. We need to speak up, every single one of us. If we don't speak up now, it's going to be too late. I don't know what else to tell you today. That's about all I'll have for you. Of course, if I missed anything, please let me know. Attach your comments or video below. Enjoy what you can, everybody. Thanks.